Okay, welcome back. You can probably hear my kids singing behind me. <laughs> um, okay, so what I'm going to do now is we're going to create a collision. So when the energy ball hits the meteorite, it destroys it. And we also want it to destroy the energy ball at the same time. Otherwise, it's just going to kind of pass right through it. So what we need to do is we're going to click on... We're going to click on the prefab because remember when I change a prefab, I change all the instances of the prefab as well. So I'm going to double click on Asteroid 2. I am just going to collapse everything so it's a bit easier to read. Um, and you can see there's a modify health attribute script on there. I'm going to add a condition, a condition component. So I'm going to go and grab this and go down. If you remember where we click on playground to access the scripts. And I'm going to click on conditions, this one right here. And the condition collision script is the one we're going to grab. So I'm going to click that once. And how this works is um, if it basically means that if something collides uh, with this game object, something's going to happen. Um, you can see it says gameplay actions. So if so if something hits this, then we want something to happen. So what we're going to do is to figure out what happens, we're going to click on the little plus sign here, and you can see there's different options that we can choose. And this is the beauty of the uh, playground, is these are all uh, pre-made scripts. So we're going to choose the one called destroy action. And we're going to choose that. And you can see suddenly, um, actually below it here, if I open that, you can see the destroy action script has been added below the condition collision script. So if um, something collides with the meteorite, it's going to be destroyed, and here's the destroy. So it says target, object that collided. Uh, we don't want that. We want this object to be destroyed, which is the meteorite. And then there's an effect here, and the effect is the animation, um, or actually I think this is a particle uh, that is going to, um, it, well, it's going to be an animation for the effect of the dis destruction. So I'm going to click on the little tiny circle. It's really, really, really small. And it says, um, we can look under self, so what's in the hierarchy, or we can click under assets. And you want to click under assets right here on the left-hand side. And you can see there's a lot of stuff going on here, but we want to focus on one of these. So, uh, explosion, let's try that one. Let's see what that does. So if I click on explosion, all right, um, let's see how this, let's see if this actually works. So we have our polygon collider, which is good, okay. And the energy ball, I'm just going to double click on the energy ball, double click it, and you can see this also has a polygon collider on it, so that means when they touch, um, that condition collision script should activate. Let's see if it actually is going to work for us here. So I'm going to click play, I'm just going to move my ship to a good spot, and fire. Boom. Nice. Boom. Good. And boom. Good. Now. That's good, but what's happening is our shot that we're creating here is actually going through the meteorite, and we want our um, energy ball to be destroyed at the same time. So we're going to do the same thing with the energy ball. All we're going to do is I'm actually on the energy ball prefab right here, um, and we're going to click on Add Component, and we're going to go down to the Playground uh, scripts, and we're going to go to conditions, and we're going to go to condition collision. Condition collision, right here. That's the same one we were working on before. And I'm just going to click the plus sign, and we're also going to do a destroy action. And this is going to be this object as well. So it's going to destroy this object here. And let's click on assets. And maybe we, let's make the um, it a bit different for the energy ball. So let's do a impact maybe. Let's try an impact and see what that does. I'm not sure what that animation looks like. Let's click play. And let's check it out. Cool. So you can see when I shoot the energy ball, it um, destroys the energy ball with that impact particle there or animation. And then the asteroid also gets destroyed as well. So we've got some uh, Good, some pretty cool uh, game mechanics going on here now, and we are ready to move to the next level.